Freight trains operate across the country and around the world carrying all sorts of cargo from place to place. They are very important to the UK economy and environment as they allow large volumes of products to be transported safely in one go, keeping lorries off the road. The many people in the railway hobby enjoy it in different ways. For some people it's the thrill of travelling to new places around the country, for others it's a way to practice their passion for photography and video making. Some people are interested in the engineering side of things, how trains are built, the engines and so on. Almost all of the freight trains are headed for Southampton docks, where containers are loaded onto container ships and products exported abroad. Containers are then loaded back onto the train with products being imported and trains return northwards. In a busy area like Southampton with its major docks, freight trains in the area are very common. On an average weekday, 20 to 30 freight trains pass through Southampton Central Railway Station. Although there are some dedicated freight-only train lines, all freight trains travel on the same national network as passenger services. Many freights run early in the morning or late at night to stop them getting in the way of passenger train services, which are more intense during the peak travel periods. Freight trains are very heavy and therefore cannot accelerate and brake as fast as a passenger train, so they have to be scheduled around passenger services so that they do not disrupt the timetable. The freight trains you see in the Southampton area come from different places around the country. Most of these locations are between 100 and 150 miles away from Southampton.